Hi, I'm Marty Pearson with IdealMarketers.com. Here to talk with you about the squirrel syndrome. If you're an inspired creative, I'm willing to bet you have suffered from the squirrel syndrome. I know I have. Have you ever seen the movie Up, where the dogs can talk? They wear these little collars that make them be able to talk. And one of the dogs trots up to this old man. And he starts talking and giving a conversation there. And then suddenly he just goes, squirrel. And then he comes back to the conversation, starts all over and, you know, chatting away. A lot of times, as inspired creative, we suffer from the squirrel syndrome. We see something that catches our attention and off we go, squirrel! And it takes us a while and we've got to start all over with what we were doing when we come back to it. And most of the time, what leads us off on a squirrel trail is money. The opportunity to make some money somewhere. Somebody, maybe somebody has a system over here that they guarantee you're going to make a lot of money if you implement this system. or. If you sell this product over here, if you do this, and the promise of the money gets us sidetracked, okay? But I'm going to let you in on a secret. <laughs> Most of the time, those side trails don't pan out. Now, sometimes you go off on a, a tangent and you pick up some skills you need. And so, some of those squirrels you're supposed to chase, but other squirrels are taking you off focus and knowing the difference between a squirrel you should look at or chase and one you should not chase is uh, something you need to learn and that's something that we're going to cover in this course. How do you know if a squirrel is one that fits with your focus and which one doesn't? And um, so anyway, the money, a lot of times that leads people off tangent and uh, you know, I know I've been let off. I've sold uh, everything from water filters to insurance to all, all kinds of stuff. You know, because somebody told me, oh, you're going to make some money over here with this. Uh, but once I learned what I'm here for and my mission, it really reduced the need to chase the squirrels. And this will happen for you too. Because it takes a lot of dedication to stick with your focus. And if you're very clear on it, you can do it and you can know what to follow and what not to follow. So, also another thing about uh, Inspired Creatives is we have a little bit of trouble just managing our time. There's a natural cycle, an ebb and flow to the way our creative cycle works and during certain points of that cycle we're more susceptible to the squirrel syndrome. And if you're just aware of that, you won't get off task. So I'm going to be talking a lot in this course about uh, your cycle, your creative cycle, and how to identify it how to use your time wisely because a lot of the typical you know Franklin planner sort of things don't work for us <laughs> we can't stand the whole schedule you know put us in a box we can't stand it um, and so but there are ways you can manage your time your energy and uh, I'm going to introduce to you a different way to manage your time and energy as well as help you break through some of the limiting beliefs and things that you have about yourself so you can really live your mission, and get your message out there in a big way. So join me for the Conquering the Squirrel program.